hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new illustrator tutorial and today i'll show you this type of logo design that means the conceptual logo but creative so let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first i'm going to the file and taking new so taking new artboard which is the custom artboard and giving the name not logo and hit the create button you'll get an artboard which is 2000 pixel by 2000 pixel or whatever I mean, the artboard measurement you can take for this experiment or your logo at first go to the line segment tool or long press over here and here go to the polar grid tool after that select once here the concentric I mean, the dividers 5 and I'm giving here the 12 and the dialer dividers I'm giving here the 0 and hit the okay button okay fine and then press the shift and hold it and make it bigger like that or you can give the value over there here i'll right press this one and ungroup that things and you have to ungroup it several times and now that's good and now i'll remove two or three circles i'll keep one two three four five six seven okay fine why we remove the central circuit just because of i want to make the shape like a knot and other steps so after that making it group now and making another copy of this one so press the alter or option button and drag it and drag it like center and for your convenience you can press the shift button and the alter button at once and then now these two things i'll make it group and after that i'll do the copy of one of them and making it center of this and just mark the shortcut keys what i am just pressing over here and making these two things are grouped and this one is non-grouped and now i'll select this key subject and making it in the middle after that resize or reposition this one like uh here now you have to measure it or you have to consider it like that i think that's great okay fine now we'll make the shape like this that means like this okay here we have just draw this one and making it like that how to do that so this one is easy process select all the circles shift m for the shape builders tools and now draw this one at first the like here these two portions okay fine so for your convenient you have to make some uh, colors for this i'm taking off just turning off the stroke and giving the separate color for the recognize here giving the blue color or other stuffs okay fine and then now draw from here so when you are drawing this one be careful about that and then just two that means one is left and then again draw this one okay fine and now just one and two just go to the downside and this one is left and make it like this so this one you are getting the s portion that means s portion and now time for the n and going to the downside and make it zoom and make it shave as well and then this portion so remember that from here we'll make it more curved like that so in this portion and then we'll make it curve so you have to make it curve like this nice and now we'll uh, lift this line and taking the another line fill from here so you have to lift this line as well just because of one line we are lifting over here from here giving here so we just done the wrong thing just because of we have to make it another line over here that means you have to take another line from here and then you have to make it like measurement otherwise um, you don't have to fill up this portion so this one now okay and it may take uh, two more times uh, it doesn't matter but uh, you have to make the logo fulfill like that so you're getting these type of things so 
so be careful uh, here um, some portion might be left you have to make sure that all portion is okay okay press v from the keyboard now time to reduce the line so uh, it's not easier to you know, delete the line one by one before that you have to make it ungroup and several time it might be ungroup okay fine and now you have to delete the lines press y for the like magic one tool select all uh, or uh, one line all line will select and delete that so now you are getting the clean version of the logo okay select all the things turn off the stroke and now time to give the color of different types of shapes so this one is one shape and another these things are two shapes ungrouping this one now you can use the gradient go to the gradient palette select the gradient pick the gradient from here it could be like this these are the orange and combination with the pink that's good and make it 90 degrees make it reverse okay fine and now time to give color over here i for the eye picker and select color from here i from here and now make it reverse so it's getting you the like a uh, real type fields and select all the portions making it group and making it in a middle you can give the uh, photo or for the background so how to do that taking rectangle according to the artboard that means 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel and make it white and just send it in a back layer so mark the shortcut keys and now i'll import a photo here go to the file and place embedded and any kind of photo could be just placing in this portion and this one is more bigger you have to make it smaller press the shift and hold it and make it more smaller and you can take this portion okay fine don't take the logo otherwise uh, two logo will uh, mismatch or overlap so don't take the logo and send this photo into the back layer that's fine and now i'll make it clipping mask and do something like that so taking another copy ctrl c and ctrl f for the front or white background select in this one and right press making it clipping mask so i'll send it into the next level or next layer and now i'll reduce the opacity of the white portion okay fine it's giving you the feel to give this uh, logo fulfill our professional look and making it bigger and now how i make it or what is the concept of this logo you can make it more appropriate how to do that i have some concept from here that means i took the s here and the n that means here is the small n and i'm taking the nuts and i'm just got this logo so i'm copying these things and I want to make the clear uh, thoughts of the designer that means i took the you know, concept over here where from i got the concept and what is the meaning of the logo uh, it is telling the story of this logo it could be the creative way to present your logo so this one is the process to make this type of creative logo hope that you will be benefited for this you have learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the new notifications and if you want to get the like more stuffs or more logo design like that in my video description there is a playlist link please check out over here until the next video i am signing out today stay safe stay at home bye bye